Hi, Paul Wagner back at the iCafe studio. Today we're going to talk about automatic replies for your email. If I come down to my screen, to set up an automatic reply, if I'm going to be out of office for an extended amount of time, I go to the File tab, and then I have an automatic replies button right here. After I click that, a little window is going to pop open. It is by default set to do not send automatic replies, so I need to first click on the little aerial button next to send automatic replies. If I just do that, automatic replies will be on until I go back in and turn it off. If I want to set it so it's for certain dates, I check the little box here, and then I can run in and use the drop down to set my dates for whatever I want to do. For this one, I'm just going to leave to send automatic replies. I then need to come down into my little wizard box here and type in whatever I want to have it say. I worked ahead, I planned ahead and I have it written down already so I'm going to just copy and paste it in there from a Word document and I am set to go for anything that is inside my organization. That would mean anything inside of LCISD if they send you an email and I have this on, it, they will get this automatic reply one time. If I wanted to go to anybody who sends me an email, I have to go to my outside my organization and then I have to make sure it's turned on here as well. I'm going to once again paste in the exact same message that I had and I click OK. Automatic replies, as you can see, is now highlighted on my screen, which means that it is turned on. And if I go back, you'll see running across the screen right below my ribbon is a little yellow one telling you that automatic replies is turned on right now. If I want to turn it off, I can just click on turn off and it will turn it off for me. If I go back to the automatic replies section again, you're going to see that it went back to do not send all by itself. I don't need to worry about it. That's all there is for automatic replies. If you have any questions, contact your CITS. Otherwise, this is Paul from the iCafe studio. Have a great day.